The other news now, the man who shot and killed a beloved basketball coach last summer will spend decades behind bars. Fox 6's Aaron Maven was in court today as the judge handed down a 30-year prison sentence. He would have been everything that you needed, exactly when you needed it, whether you liked it or not. Family members of Dale Young speak about his life and the void left behind after his death. I'm here today, a broken mother who have lost every sense of normalcy. Their emotional testimony came during the sentencing of Amarty Stotts. The 31-year-old pleaded guilty to first-degree reckless homicide in connection with Young's July 2023 death. I'm taking full responsibility for my behavior that day. And if I could take it all back, I would. I promise you I would. Dale Young was a prominent Milwaukee youth basketball coach. Family says he was trying to get a family member out of an abusive relationship when he was shot near 69th and Carmen. Security video shows the chaos that day. Prosecutors say Stotts was a friend of someone in that relationship and confronted Young before opening fire. The crazy thing is he would have helped his killer had his killer came to him and asked for anything in this world. My brother would have made sure he had it. That's the kind of man he was. After Stotts took a plea, the district attorney's office recommended 23 to 25 years in prison. But Young's family asked the judge for the maximum penalty. He does not deserve mercy since he had no mercy for my baby. Not even a year after the crime, Judge Ellen Brostrom handed down this sentence. A uh, term in the Wisconsin state prison of 42 years with 30 years of initial confinement and 12 years of extended supervision is appropriate given the gravity of the offense. At the Milwaukee County Courthouse, Aaron Maben, Fox 6 News.